Hi friends, good morning. This is Abhishek from TechWirus and today I'll be telling you how can you troubleshoot your Wi-Fi problem in Samsung Galaxy S4. Uh, I purchased this phone last week and uh, from the first day I'm facing this uh, Wi-Fi problem but I have figured it out how to resolve it. So within 10 minutes you can resolve this problem and there will be no issues with the Wi-Fi. Okay, let me start with the phone, uh, how you can set it up. Uh, first of all what you need to do is uh, uh, press your dialer then in dialer you need to go and type in star hash zero zero one one hash this will open service mode and inside service mode if you see if you press on the left hand side there is an option called Wi-Fi click on that Wi-Fi on this option you have Wi-Fi power save mode you can see here it's on by default it's on so you need to switch it off if your Wi-Fi signal is dropping again and again just you need to press in here it will switch it off Wi-Fi reset apply okay now just click back hit back and go back now it will switch off your Wi-Fi and restart it again okay so this is first step you need to do in your mobile then uh, leave your mobile and go to your laptop or desktop and open the routers home page okay I'll show you the ASUS home page which I'm using at my home so you need to go into ASUS web page uh, or your whatever uh, Wi-Fi router you're using by just typing 192.168.1.1 or 2 whatever is your local IP address for your router for me it's 192.168.2.10 so once you open the page it will ask for the password uh, so by default most of the routers have username as admin and password as admin so you type in those things and come into wireless setting there would be wireless option in your router just click on this then you will get these options such as SSID, SSID name, then bandwidth, then other thing, I appreciate, and what type of security you want. So uh, you need to do a few things before you set this channel and wireless mode. First of all, you need to understand what type of router you have. If you have N router, then you can set wireless mode as N only because this is the fastest mode which can you which you can use in your router I have multiple options and BG max and G only so I have selected N only because it's the fastest and most reliable source now the channel bandwidth you can select 2040 depending upon how you have what router you have they will have more options but here we have 20 or 40 select like this then now come to channel channel how will you select the channel channel needs to be selected very carefully which channel is best for your home your home location you need to find it out how will you find out which channel suits you best there is an application in android i'll show you you need to find which channel suits your environment or your home or your office location okay you need to go to play store and download this application called Wi-Fi analyzer I have downloaded it here so just click Wi-Fi analyzer so once you click this and keeping your Wi-Fi on you will see all the signal strength of all the nearby Wi-Fi routers so if you see the bottom these are the channels 1 2 3 4 5 6 2 12 if you, you can see there are conditions in 12 10 all those things so you need to select a channel where the, you have less conditions so I have selected three or four I have selected four because you see the four is not too much congested if I selected one there are lots of Wi-Fi router operating in the system so I have selected four so channel I have set it in my Wi-Fi router page as 4 you can see this yeah set channel as 4 now extension channel you can tell it to 8 so it, depending upon the situation it changes now authentication mode I have selected WPA2 personal 
and WPA inscription is AES. Okay. So uh, I've seen people are selecting TKPI or another uh, encryption, but for me AES is working pretty good. So before doing all these things, one most important thing you need to do is you need to update your firmware version of your router. So I have updated my router version to 2.0.2.5F. This is the latest uh, firmware of my router. How will you update the router's uh, firmware of your router? It's pretty easy depending upon your router's application. There will be lots of options. So in this case, in Ashu's, you need to go to advanced settings. Inside advanced settings, there will be option called firmware upgrade. So if you click on firmware upgrade, it will open this kind of page. So in this page, you just need to go to the link which is mentioned here ASUS website and it will take you to the website and once you take go to this website and search for your router in my case my router name is this this is my complete name I'll search my router then I'll, sell, I'll uh, select the latest firmware and download it and after downloading I need to browse and upload so it will reinstall and reboot the uh, Wi-Fi router so this way, first you need to upgrade your router firmware, then do these wireless settings, what I just told you, like setting up the channel, the type of encryption, and bandwidth, all those things. Once this is set, reboot your Wi-Fi router, switch off the wireless in your phone, and restart it. So once you restart, it should work perfectly without any problem you see my signal strength is really good don't have any difficulties uh, let me show you if I just remove Wi-Fi it got disconnected now I'll switch on the Wi-Fi again now you see how nice it will get connected yes this Wi-Fi is here okay so I hope you like this video thank you have a nice day.